the people that you see Follow me Follow me down Tell all the people that you see Set them free Follow me down You tell them they don't Represent blacks. <laughs> yes, if you don't understand what I'm saying, please ask me to repeat it. Because no, I don't know the hell what I'm saying. You know what will happen? This guy will go home and he'll watch the movie. Somebody will say to him, Well, what was he talking about? And he'll say, I oh, don't run from that. A lot of bad news to around these speakers today. A lot of very bad news. <laughs> Do you agree? Yes, Professor Early. There are many others, including myself, and there's others that have individually looked at it. Now, in my opinion. But Jesus' graveyard in Israel is empty. Why? Why is it empty? You see, that is the heart of the gospel. The gospel simply means good news, not bad news. Sir, you have, you beat to me. Do you masturbate? I don't. Sometimes, <laughs> man used to masturbate all the time. <laughs> That's why you're uptight. Five times this morning. <laughs> He's in pain with Wrong. it. Wrong. <laughs> huh? Two times. Oh! Okay. <laughs> Okay? I, come, I come to speak a scorn and to relax. 
I come to listen to stupid people, okay? Yeah. I didn't come here to think, all right? Yeah, really. London is famous for tourists and lunatics. When we say English, what do we mean by English? Hello. <laughs> Are we talking about nationalism, ethnicity, race, or football? Is there enough football? I want a whiskey! <laughs> I deserve a whiskey, you know that. I deserve this. Anyway, in terms of ethnicity, what ethnic group does the Irish belong to? Hmm? <laughs> Are the Irish Germans? No. No. Are they French? No, no. They're Irish. Irish. Are, Irish. Irish. Are they Celts? Yeah, we're French. Are, Are, the Are they Celtic? No. Yeah. Yeah. Who are the indigenous of the British Isles? You don't even know your own history, Colors of Irish? You're crazy. You're crazy. You don't even know who you are. You're crazy. You hear that? They have a constitution. They don't pay the poll tax. You know, they, they get away with murder over there. You know that? If it wasn't for the IRA, there will be no Irish football team today. If there was no Irish Republic, there would be no, I no Irish football team. Oh, it's like the Americans. When we were running America, yeah. 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 we used to have a tea party every Sunday. We used to play cricket. And all the Irishmen, all the Irishmen who tried to speak in their language under the empire, we used to deport them to America, the colonists. Do you know how many Irish men in Shanghai to the colonists in America? We used to go to the pub, buy them beer, and hit them over the head. Wow! They end up on a big ship. America! Sorry? Why didn't they hit you back? Listen, I don't want to talk about the Irish. I need a whistle. So you're saying we're not good No, that's not. You are troublemakers. You and the Americans. You do not respect our king. We do not expect our rules and parliament. You have to create your own parliaments, your own football team. Now you're beating us at our own game. Is that our fault? You are supposed to be slaves of Britain. You are supposed to be like the Africans and the Indians. You're supposed to be Commonwealth slaves. Bloody Republicans. The only pub we know about is the bloody public house. Whiskey. I want whiskey! <laughs> and please, not Irish whiskey, please. Yeah, I want American whiskey. Yeah. Southern comfort. <laughs> now, do you understand what I'm saying? No. no. There's no difference between the Irish and the English people. Oh, don't be silly. Don't be ridiculous. The Irish, the Irish don't be ridiculous. <laughs> don't be ridiculous. Hold on. The Irish could be English, but the English cannot be Irish. No. Why not? We don't want to be. What is Englishness? We don't want to be. What is Ireland? What is the area? What are the ge geological factors? What is the culture, geography of Ireland? It's history? You go and ask. Go on. If you go and ask anyone about Ireland, they'll phone the police. They think you're IRA. Uh, yeah, we're IRA. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know that in London, a mugger, a nigger could go and beat a white woman with a baseball bat outside a supermarket and they will call him schizophrenic? But if an Irish guy leave an Irish pub and he, does, he can't walk straight, the police will keep him for two weeks. They said he's a leader of the IRA in London. Do you know that Irish people could be picked up under the emergency? Terrorist acts, you know that? They have the two weeks. Hmm? Even criminals have more rights in London 
Then the Irish. Did you know that? Did you know that? Did you know that? Did you know that? No, we do now. I don't know what I'm talking about. I want a whiskey. I want a whiskey. We know that. We know that. I want whiskey. Have you ever been to Ireland? I am in Ireland. You're in London. Oh, in Ireland. This is London. Wherever the Irish people are is Ireland. <laughs> Someone said to me some time ago, he said, why is it? that the Jewish people and the Irish people always talk about home, but they never go there. I want a whiskey, man. I'm, I'm, I'm thirsty, I want a drink. I want to have some fun. You know? <laughs> hey, whiskey, ha uh ha! -huh. An angel has arrived. Hey, Lord! Thank you for alcohol. <laughs> Thank you for England, Lord, that I can drink alcohol without being flogged 40 times by a Muslim. <laughs> the Irish couldn't do this in Saudi Arabia. What do you mean? What do you mean? Rubbish. Wherever the Irish go, they do what they want. You don't know what the Irish are. We don't know what the Irish are, but we are Irish. You're right. And he doesn't need the British. Irish whiskey. What's in that water? Hallelujah! You are lucky today that I have some whiskey. Now we're going to have some fun, yes? Yes. Now we have some fun. Now we're going to have some fun. We're going to entertain us now. Yes, okay, because yeah. I have my whiskey. Do dance first. Do dance first. Do dance I have my whiskey. See, British I have my whiskey. This is not entertainment, I'd like to tell you. There's many things. Well, I don't give a damn because if I get a whiskey, I, when I drink my whiskey, let me tell you, two things happen. I get very happy and I don't care what's outside of me. Secondly, anybody upset me, I get very violent when I'm drunk. All right? So, you guys, it's up to you. If you want to be bad, I'm drinking, there's going to be a lot of blood today. If you want to be happy, it's not a threat. I'm telling you what's going to happen. <laughs> if you want to be happy, we're going to be very happy. We can uh, shut up! Your shut up! Shut up! You don't know what you're saying. You don't even know what you do not know. I am drunk. I can say what I want. Now, I am not a alcoholic, yes? I only drink... I'll tell you why I drink. I drink in order to protest. Because our culture glorifies pain. Our culture glorifies suffering. If women do not suffer, they would not be accepted. What about men don't suffer? Our culture penalizes hedonism. If you seek pleasure, enjoyment, and happiness, you're in big trouble. Yes? Good. Now, let's talk about sex. <laughs> Let's talk about sex. What do you know of sex? Good. Well, I shall start. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I would prefer, before I speak, that we're all in mad people here. We're all Muslims, blacks, whites, please leave. No. Are you white? Yes. Then why do you think you are white? Because you were born that way. You were born white. No, I'm not. Have you ever seen white? Yes. Have you ever looked in a mirror? Yes. 
Do you look no. white? No, I look, no, I look pink. Good. Green. Well, how come you call pink white? You need a doctor. Yeah. I am yeah. drunk and I can tell the difference between pink and white. You're racist. I am racist just because... You're drunk. Now. So who are you? Good. Okay, Do you have to be white to be Irish? No. no. Good. So Irishness has nothing to do with color. No. But you're making that point. Now, have you heard of Kennedy? No. Yes. Yes. Have you heard of Duke of Wellington? No. Yes. no. Have you heard of Bernard Shaw? No. no. Yes. Have you heard of Oscar Wilde? Yes. 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 No. And who wrote Ulysses? I did. Yeah. We did. We did. <laughs> James Joyce. James Joyce. Now these are positive things about Ireland. So no stereotyping here, okay? I don't want you to construct <coughs> negative stereotypes of Ireland. Because I don't want any Irish person to end up in the tribunal. If we weren't here, would you bring the subject of Irish people and Irish? You don't know what you're saying. I do know what you're saying. Do you know what you're saying? We're children, we're children, we're children. Now, being Irish is a very advanced political state. Are you Irish? Listen, shut up! Don't ask me questions. Are you a policeman or something? No, I'm not. What's the question? Why not? Why not? You're black and we're white. I am not black. Did I tell you I was black? No, no, you're not. Well, poor. don't put labels on me. You're a traitor. You're putting it on us. You're putting it on us. Not I that. didn't put any label on you. I ask you, who are you? And you tell me you're white. You tell me you're Irish. Well, who are you? You change your mind of being white. And now who you speak with Irish. Me? I'm Terminator 24. <laughs> Yes. I took a quantum leap into this nigga body here. Yeah. And I'm James Jones. Damn right you are. Never forget that. Where are we? I don't know who I am. Yes? Good. Good. Anyway, who am I anyway? Yeah. 24. I am not an exterminator. I'm no ex, okay? I'm a terminator. I am here to terminate the terminator book. Now, how did you do well in your exams this year? I didn't get it. Good. Now, I'll make a short introduction and then we will talk about sex. I don't know who I am. I do not represent blacks. Yes, if you don't understand what I'm saying, please ask me to repeat it. No. Because I don't know the hell what I'm saying, all right? I don't represent blacks. I don't represent... I don't... I need a biscuit. I need... Never mind what I need. I don't represent... Sorry? Okay, I don't represent any political party, but I love parties. I love partying. I do not represent any religious group or sect. Yes? But I'm very compassionate towards religious people. Yes? That's why I have adopted a religion called horsepower or its equivalent. I do not consider it blasphemy when religious people waste energy. I find religious people very interesting. They claim that there is a better place in this cosmos called heaven, better than this fragile earth. But religious people are not dying to go to the heavens. They're not dying to go to see their gods. Instead, they prefer to cut your throat so you meet their god before they do in order to take your land, 
money and your children. Okay? Now, this is not a religious meeting. Please do not believe in what I'm saying. Try to understand what I'm talking about. Because I may not know what I'm talking about. You're on your own, okay? It's up to you to make sense of what's going on. Now, we talk about sex. Now, let me... Oscar Wilde. Oscar Wilde? Yes. Read us some. Men kill the thing they love. Brave men with the sword, cowards do it with a kiss. The ballad of Red and Gold. Also, there are other verses. But you don't know. My friend, I don't know. That's true. <laughs> but I love Oscar Wilde because he won an Oscar by being wild. <laughs> Now we were talking about sex. Now, the problem of talking about sex is talking. Full stop. Talking can create a lot of problems. Problems could be creating by talking. Understanding problems could be achieved by talking. And more understanding by talking about talking. So what's your point? If there isn't a point, then I'll leave. Okay. Since it's impossible. Because since if you want to walk in the rain without being wet, how can you do it? Thank you, brother. Thank you. Who said that? Thank you. Now, if you want to talk about sex and sexism without being sexist or feeling sexy, how are you going to achieve that? No, he knows. He's a smart guy. By using, by using an analytical umbrella. You didn't know that, did you? No. See how complex an umbrella can become. Now I'm going to use a bit of Gramsci here, right? We're all intellectuals. Everybody's intellectual, even though they don't know it. Yeah! What we're dealing here is down to earth stuff yeah, here, yeah. right? Common sense. Are we talking about the sense of being common? Or the commonness of sense? Common sense means that we all have a sense, and you know, we, we see the world, the world is what it is. We've got a big cultural problem in this planet. The face in the mirror won't stop. What do we do with underdevelopment? One half of the world is overdeveloped, Intellectually, and the other half is underdeveloped. Yeah? What do we do? Cancel my subscription to the resurrection. This meeting is going to become an underdeveloped meeting. Send my credentials to the house of detention. I got some friends inside. 
Knowledge is in you. Yeah? Yes. Not from outside of you. This is the stupidest corner. You're all equal. I am more stupid than most. That's why I speak. Let me know. 